A border town in Arizona is seeing the cost of the migrant surge firsthand. The mayor has to use city funds to provide aid and COVID tests to these migrants. And that's where Hillary Vaughan is right now. And Hillary, you tell us, how much is this costing the city? Well, COVID test, Stuart, the way they budgeted it, uh, if they drop two busloads of migrants every week throughout the year, that's going to cost here in this town in Gila Bend, Arizona, $600,000. That is over a third of the city's entire budget for the year. And that is why mayors in small towns along the U.S.-Mexico border are telling us that they are being left behind by President Biden's border policy. And Chris Riggs, the mayor here, tells me that President Biden is creating a crisis in his community by dumping these migrants off by the busload here in Gila Bend, Arizona. Border Patrol let us know that they were going to be uh, dropping migrants that had been detained for more than 70, or 72 hours um, in our town, which we really didn't understand because we have nothing here. There's a huge monetary issue, um, criminal activity. We have no facilities. We do not have a hospital here. This is exclusive video you're seeing. This is the very first drop off that happened in his town. It happened yesterday. 15 migrants loaded off into his town. But until yesterday, the mayor was able to divert the first two buses full of migrants that were supposed to head to his town. He could not stop this one, though. He does say it is putting a massive strain on his community financially. But also, they are seeing an uptick in crime. It is not just a drain on their budget that they're worried about. Just this year, U.S. Border Patrol has encountered counted over 4,000 illegal immigrants who have been convicted of a crime. That is already double the number of migrants that they encountered last year. And Arizona ranchers on the border say they are seeing an increase in illegal border crossers crossing into their backyard. And one rancher told me that that has caused 15 of his neighbor ranchers to sell their ranch along the border. They can't deal with it. Uh, they can't afford to deal with it. Uh, they don't want to raise their children there where they have to do that type of thing and protect them all the time. Uh, and, and it's not just President Biden that's out of touch. It's the whole um, uh, administration. And, Stuart, it... To have a ranch along the U.S. border costs 35 percent more just because you have to repair broken fencing and stolen water that illegal border crossers are stealing that they use to feed their cattle. Stuart? That is absolutely outrageous. It's, a, it's an invasion any way you slice it. Thanks, Hillary.